Our next guest is the CEO of a company called Mapbox. All right, they make software that helps self-driving cars get down that road. Now, Mapbox is teaming up with Microsoft and Intel. They're going to take on Google Maps. Eric Gunderson is with us now. Welcome to the show, Eric. Good to see you. Stuart, good to see you. Now, first of all, I take it that your product doesn't just work with self-driving cars. I could use it in my own car, which I'm driving. Is that correct? That, that is correct. And, you know, I got a feeling you and a bunch of other folks are already using Mapbox inside their apps. So, unlike Google, we don't have, we don't have an app. We just have code and SDKs that let developers build maps directly into their applications and their products. Eric, so, you totally lost me. You, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, who, where do I start with this? <laughs> I haven't a clue what you're right. talking about, first of all. Watch it, watch this, watch this. Let me, let me make it simple. Um, have you used uh, Snapchat or, uh, or Tinder in the last, uh, last little bit? No. no. Stuart on all Tinder? Right, right. Uh, weather Channel. Yes. Right. Yes. You, you open yes. up. You open up Weather's apps. Yes. All right. So yeah. open up your Weather app on your phone. Yep. All that live data, you get to see the storms moving. That's yep. all on top of our maps. Or you know, you order your groceries with Instacart, or you look for a gym on on ClassPass. Uh, mm -hmm. News alerts. Right. You're probably using Bloomberg yep. uh, for news yep. alerts. Yep. All those Not maps. Bloomberg. No. Fox. So, Fox. It's called Fox. F O X. <laughs> Fox. <laughs> no, <what? laughs> Jeez. Uh, point is, anybody. And I, I really look forward to having Fox also using our maps. We, we should talk about that separately. <laughs> but any developer can put our stuff in there. Look, the point is, location is critical to everything, whether you're making an app or, uh, or you're building a car. Okay. Okay, I'm driving along in my car. Uh, how do I get Mapbox to tell me the directions to XYZ? Yeah. We're working directly with the OEMs and other key partners. And this is why... Uh, Yesterday's announcement with, uh, with Microsoft Azure was such a big deal for us, right? So we allow car makers, like the designers and the developers yep. in Detroit, to go that are like, they, they care so much about what the look of the car looks like. And then you walk into the car, and right now the dashboard is just, you know, it's garbage. But what if we can allow those designers and developers to put not just good-looking maps in there that actually feel like the maps on your phone, but with real-time data? And so right now we've got 350 million people a month touching our maps and every time our maps are used we get live data coming back and that's what's allowing us to live map all the roads so you got latitude yeah. longitude and timestamp and boom you can see the live traffic everything that's fascinating I wish we had more time and then maybe I'd understand how to use this thing but it, it sounds <laughs> fascinating map box going up against Google Maps with a better map have I got that right yeah, yes, no, I, I just I never thought we'd pop the pop the Microsoft stock this quick after the announcement, but uh, <laughs> oh wait a minute, are you claiming credit for Microsoft getting to hundred dollars a share? I can't do that. I gotta it go, Eric. I gotta go. I gotta go. But that was good stuff. Thanks very much. All right.